receive uh, when we get a cello track nano device uh, this is the box which we receive and the contents in the box are as, are as follows uh, we receive a device this is a cello track nano device these are the two multi sense uh, this is a multi sense with humidity and this is a multi sense without humidity and the other accessories which we receive are the usb cable to charge the device uh, an adapter to connect it to a wall socket the third thing is a cradle which can be used to connect to a device and the other things are the magnets and the uh, mounting screws which are required to uh, install the device in a way so in this video i'll explain you how to turn on the device uh, how to insert the sim card in the device uh, how to connect the device to PC and again how to uh, turn off the device so to insert the sim card uh, we have a screw over here we will have to remove that screw This is the internal PCB and we have to insert the SIM card over here. Okay, while inserting the SIM card, the SIM card position must be like this so that uh, the connections are proper. Okay, like this. So we'll just have to push it in. Now we'll again uh, put on the cover and to turn on the device this is a left key which is used for turning on and off the device uh, we'll have to press it for more than 5 seconds to turn it on Okay, when we turn on, turn on the device, uh, a, bat a battery indication is mentioned here on this LED and we get the GSM and the GPS status here on this LED. So for connecting the device to PC, we have a USB cable uh, which can be connected to the device here and to the PC, we have to connect it to a USB port. So first of all, whenever we connect the device we have to see on which uh, com port is the device connected so we go in device manager in device manager we go in ports and we see the com port is connected at com port number 5 so we go in so look at the programmer select the com port 5 over here and then we for querying the device we use this tab so all the information regarding the device is received over here ok now to turn off the device now to turn off the device we will have to press this button again for more than 5 seconds After these two beeps, uh, it will we will be sure that the device is turned off now. Thank you.